I'm Justice Jones and I'm Marija Santinello and we're here with YTV News getting a closer look on the Spirit Week. How much time did you spend planning this outfit? Um, this outfit took me like probably a couple minutes. I just went to the store and got some stuff. Uh, I planned my outfit yesterday like for two hours. But Honestly, I threw it together pretty quickly this morning because I was sort of in a rush but I found the safety belt. I just basically looked in my closet and found the most bright clothing I possibly could and just threw on the safety belt. Um, I spent like all last night planning this outfit in this morning. Uh, about like 10 minutes. Uh, well, a week prior we like stop and go to stores and go through my closet and we try preparing the outfits ahead of time. What class do you think is going to win? Uh, definitely the sophomore class. Um, I think the seniors are going to win, just because they win every year. I think juniors are going to win. Yeah. I mean, I want the juniors to win, obviously, but freshmen are looking good. Seniors. The freshmen. Why do you think Spirit Week is a important part of high school? Um, it just shows like who everyone is, and it gives people a chance to show who they really are. Uh, keeps the keeps the school alive. I think it's important to like show up for homecoming and just have fun. It's something fun, something different, and it bonds us all together. Uh, something fun to do compared to like constant studying and tests. It gives you like a break. It's good to see you all show your very pride this week. I'm Justice Jones. And I'm Maricha Santinello. Reporting here from YTV News. And now back to you. Biology rules. <laughs> Woo! Thank you. Reporting for YTV News, I'm Yasmin Gonzalez. During last weekend's homecoming, our students bought and wore Teddy's products. Let's take a look at our hardworking students. I'm Justin Canadas, reporting with YTV News here at Teddy's Flower Shop. As they prepare for homecoming, I'm here with Cassidy to get the inside scoop. Uh, I'm Cassidy, I'm a floral student, and I work here at Teddy's. How is Teddy's preparing for homecoming sales? Right now, it's a lot of, like, uh, corsage and boutonniere orders, and it's just a lot of ribbon prep, so we can put the flowers in at the end of the week. Does Teddy sell year-round? And if so, what does that include? We do normally sell year-round, but because of COVID and other restrictions, we aren't right now. But we can still take some specialty orders, and normally we sell small bouquets with roses, carnations, and some filler greens. Are you teaching? Are you teaching? I'm pretending to. If I gave you a plane ticket to go anywhere in the world, where would you go? You hesitated. It's supposed to be quick. Egypt. Why? Pyramids. Math. Don't walk away. Don't walk away. Narda clean. <laughs> Why? Because nobody there and I don't like people. I'm coming. Ready? If I give you if I give you a plane ticket for anywhere in the world, where would you go? Japan. Um, no hesitating! No hesitating, I'd probably go to Paris just because I like to look at all the lights. If I give you a plane ticket to go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Um, You're hesitating. Uh, Quick, uh, ja hurry! Jamaica! Play date? Plane <laughs> ticket! Oh, plane ticket? Hawaii. Why? Because it's, the weather's nice, <laughs> lay out in the beach. Ask me a question. If I give you a plane ticket for anywhere in the world, where would you go? Good talk. Wait, if I give you a plane ticket for any in the world, anywhere in the world, where would you go? I don't know. What? Anywhere in the world? Uh. No uh, hesitation. Maybe Canada. Perfect.
Could you do this RHS? Yeah, I'm in trouble. <laughs>